Emojis, no. No emojis. What's up, socials? Happy Sexy Wednesday. Today I'm gonna take a Twitter question from my friend, DC Title Guy. Woo! He said, would you ever do a WordPress plugins video? Best to have, well, here you have it. Today I'm gonna to talk about my favorite WordPress plugins, in which case I should probably preface this conversation in saying, do not go crazy downloading WordPress plugins. The more plugins you download, the slower your website's gonna be. You really need to prioritize because all these different functionalities are working at the same time every time your website loads, and the slower it loads, the more likely your people are not gonna stick around. Also, Definitely don't download all of these plugins at one time. And don't delete a bunch of plugins at one time. If you do all this activity, your website just decides to shut down sometimes, and that's really annoying, because then you gotta sit on live chat with your web host and be like, I did it again, I did it again, help me out, please fix it. So let's move on to my favorite plugin, shall we? Yes, we shall. First, broken link checker is exactly how it sounds. It's not good to have links that are not working on your site because you know what, if somebody sees a piece of content they like in Google search and it's on your website and they go to it and something is not working on that page that they really wanted to look into, that's super annoying. So just don't have any links that aren't working. Even if you don't have something to replace it with, it, I've had this happen a lot. Tools that I've suggested, they just go crashing into the ether of we no longer have funding and no longer can work for you. So so I have to delete those links. This thing will tell me, it checks my website anytime there's a link that goes to nothing so that you can either edit it or delete it, whatever you wanna do. My next favorite is tweet old post. Again, exactly as it sounds. This is a great plugin to help you get all of your content out there more than just right after you publish it. I create three videos a week. Sometimes I forget to go back and market ones that I did last week. Tweet old post will help you create your settings so it'll go back through your old content and send out tweets periodically so that you can market more of that stuff that you forgot about. So this is really useful because there may have been a great video that you did and it's just kind of fallen off your radar because you're powering forward with your editorial calendar and it will pimp that out for you automatically on your Twitter account. Next plugin you definitely need to check out is WordPress Editorial Calendar. This is great. It's integrated seamlessly into the dashboard so you can look at all of your posts and where they are on the calendar. You can, if you think of something that you want to do in the future, you can create a draft really quickly just by clicking on the calendar. It's great for getting an overall look of what content you have going out over a period of time. I like this because I log into WordPress regularly, but I only look at Google Analytics formally and in depth once a month. So by being able to see a quick synopsis of what's been going on in the last 30 days and my most popular posts and some other traffic stats, it's right there on the home screen for WordPress and it's so much easier for me to keep up with on a daily basis. That's all for today's socials. I appreciate you tuning in. As always, those are my favorite WordPress plugins. If you have a good one, please leave it in the comments. I do like them. If they're worth it for slowing down my website a little bit more, I definitely like to hear about them. So definitely let me know if you like one. Definitely. Because I say the word definitely all the time, definitely. Also make sure you subscribe to my email newsletter. That is where you get more marketing lifestyle goodness and a little bit more intimate connection with me. I have an open email policy, so people that get my newsletter, they're much more likely to remember to email me and ask me questions, and I always write back. So definitely something you should look into. And make sure you subscribe to this channel on YouTube and tweet me, at Schmantastic and at Savvy Sexy Social, and I will see you tomorrow for Social Thursday.